being born here and growing up here, we just have a love for this community. You could go play in the park and never worry about a thing. You know, for hours you would not be home. You know, you played in the creek beds. And I want my children and grandchildren to feel some of that as well. My name is Marie Glenn. I am the owner of Heavenly Treasures Quilt Shop in Pawnee City. About 15 years ago, we built a house and retired in Pawnee City. We came back to our community to help build it back up. The hardware store was going to be sold and um, it wasn't getting a buyer, so they had talked about closing it down. If the hardware store were to close, we felt like people would go out of town for their hardware needs. They would buy anything else they needed while they were out of town. And so that would cause a demise of other businesses in town as well. I don't know what we do with this without the true value in town. It drives a little bit far. Yes. <laughs> so we knew nothing about hardware but we bought that store so we could help revive our town. It's just slowly dwindling. There's a Dollar General store that's being built. Anytime you can bring new business and employees into town, it's perceived as helping your town grow. That kind of a store has a wide variety of inventory. So it, it is a concern about how much it will impact our local businesses that have been around for years and years. They do have some hardware items. They do have grocery items. They have vitamins and things like that that our drugstore carries. And it's, it's kind of scary. But we're survivors, so we'll just have to adjust to having this story in our community. You know, in the real world, competition sharpens you. So you have to just take that and let it sharpen you rather than give up.